is sad and civil and suits well for a servant with my fortunes. Where is Malvolio? He's coming, madam, but in very strange manner. He is sure possessed, madam. Uh, why? What, what's the matter? Does he rave? No, madam. He does nothing but smile. Your ladyship were best to have some guard about you if he come. For sure the man is tainted in his wits. Maria's warning Olivia that Malvolio's acting strangely. Of course, the reason he's behaving like this is because he's read the fake letter. The letter told him to wear silly clothes, smile a lot and chat Olivia up. Malvolio thinks he's in with a chance with Olivia. Why appear you with this ridiculous boldness before my lady? Be not afraid of greatness. It was well read. What means that by that, Malvolio? Some are born great. Huh? Some achieve greatness. What is that? And some have greatness thrust upon oh, them. Story. Remember who commended thy yellow stockings? Thy yellow stockings? And wish to see me cross God. Cross God? Go to, thou art made if thou desirest to be so. Am I made? If not, let me see thee a servant still. Why, this is the very midst of a madness. Olivia's so confused by Malvolio's behaviour. She thinks either she or he has gone mad. She can't understand why he's saying these strange things and wearing strange yellow stockings. Remember, he's her chief servant and he's acting very boldly. Not how you'd expect a servant to act in front of his boss. <laughs> Do you come near me now? No worse man than Sir Toby. To look to me, this concurs directly with the letter. She sends for him on purpose that I may appear stubborn to him. For she incites me to that in the letter. Mm. Cast thy humble slough, says she, be opposite with the kinsman, surly with servants. Let thy tongue tang with arguments of state. Put thyself into the trick of singularity. Malvolio's feeling positive that everything's going perfectly. He's saying that by following the instructions from Olivia's fake letter, he'll win her heart. When characters speak to themselves on stage in this way, it's called a soliloquy. Malvolio is using his soliloquy to practice the rude conversations he plans to have with other characters. <laughs> I have lined her. But it is Jove's doing. And Jove, make me thankful. <laughs>